Test Center, meteorologist Brian Nisnansky. All right, we may have turned the calendar page to April, but it'll feel more like, say, late February for today. High temperatures will only be in the middle 30s, wind chills, teens, and 20s through the day. So we got another Arctic air mass moving in here from Canada. Thanks, Canada, for all your cold uh, we've been seeing over the last several weeks. In fact, some locations today will be about 15 to 20 degrees uh, below normal across the Midwest. Precision satellite and radar this morning. We got mainly clear skies across the state, so at least we're going to see bright sunny skies. If you're headed down towards Milwaukee for Brewers opening day, you're going to have bright sunny skies, but it's going to be windy. It's going to be cold, dressed like you're going to a December Packer game. So as we look off towards the north here, a couple lake effect snow showers near Marquette, Michigan. Uh, that's about it. 24 degrees, your current temperature in Green Bay, currently 23 in Appleton, looking down College Avenue, clear skies overhead. Across the Midwest, it's 8 in International Falls, 19 in Minneapolis, uh, 29 in Chicago, across northeastern Wisconsin, 20 in Fish Creek, 24 in Oshkosh. Compare these numbers to yesterday, and it's 11 degrees colder in Shawano, 13 degrees colder in Kiwani, 12 degrees colder in Manitowoc. As far as our highs here, the next seven days, 35 only today. The normal high is 47, so we're a far cry from that. 38 degrees on Tuesday, uh, 44 on Wednesday, up to around 49 on Thursday. All right, let's go through the forecast highlights. Another push of cold Canadian air for today, so it will be cold, windy, and sunny these next few days with high pressure. And then it looks like our pattern changes a little bit as we head into uh, this weekend and next week. It becomes a bit more active, but it also becomes uh, quite a bit more spring-like, so our temperatures on average will start to warm up quite a bit. All right, the Midwestern satellite light and radar. You can see that as we look across the Midwest here, some showers down to the south of us. That's with the cold front that passed through uh, yesterday late afternoon and evening that brought that quick little burst of snow uh, to northeastern Wisconsin. As we head into this evening, uh, maybe a few clouds overhead. That's about it. Besides that, mainly clear skies tonight and I think precision cast is overdoing the cloud cover for tomorrow. I think we'll have mostly sunny skies again tomorrow and then high pressure brings sunny skies again uh, for us on Wednesday. Your forecast for today, mostly sunny, a high of 35, windy and chilly. For tonight, a low of 19, mainly clear, breezy and cold. Here's your seven day, uh, 38 Tuesday, 44 on Wednesday, 49 on Thursday. A very small chance for showers on Thursday. Looks like a better chance for rain, unfortunately, lands right on the weekend. Uh, looks like Saturday could be pretty soggy. In fact, it may end up being cold enough, at least north of Green Bay, to see a little bit of mixing of snow uh, late Saturday and into Sunday. So we're going to have to keep an eye on that. Snow in April. Is yes. that strange? Um, Unusual for here? You know, even? really not. It, it, it's it's pretty typical that we'll see it every once in a while. It's just for us, it's been so consistently cold mm -hmm. that I think we're so ready for it to be done. Ready for some warmth. Yeah. <laughs>